patients uh, prior to their surgery, um, we place sequentials on them. These sequentials help increase blood flow while the procedure is going on to therefore eliminate the possibility of getting a blood clot. However, there are some patients who do screen preoperatively very high as far as getting a blood clot after a surgery is performed. Um, in that instance, we do send home patients with sequentials that they wear during the surgery. In that case, we're just going to show you how to put these sequentials on at home. Uh, it comes with two. Does not matter which one goes on which leg. Uh, you simply un Velcro the three Velcro tabs. You put the leg right on, calf up, uh, calf the wide part to the top of the calf, bottom towards the ankle, and you simply just wrap the sequential on the patient. However, you do not want to make sure that it is too tight. So a good finger length, a finger width um, wiggle room is perfect. You do the same for the other leg. And if you forget, there are instructions on the actual compression device. Once we are set and hooked up and we were fitted well, we have two connectors here, one from each sequential. They then plug into the unit here that actually pumps up periodically to provide the circulation of blood flow in the legs. You simply hook the ports in to the two attached ports. It does again, does not matter which one goes into what port. Our machines are pre-programmed, so all it does, it makes it easy for patients. You hit simply hit the power button. And once the machine is on, all you have to do is hit the DVT button one time. At this point, each sequential takes uh, brief episodes of pumping up a selected amount of air um, within the device to increase the blood flow within the leg. We encourage these to be worn on patients if they are home, relaxing, and not walking at the time. Um, however, we do encourage, again, early ambulation as the key factor in preventing blood clots from forming. We also send patients home with a leg and foot exercise as we described earlier in another video and the risk for blood clots on the back.